I've always been involved with uh, design and studying design and getting excited about the way things look and my life has been one of appreciating things that are um, a certain way. I'm trained in architectural design. I'm very proud of the work that I've done over the years. Uh, a novel that I've written that was published and has a great following and my photography that's uh, in exhibit today in uh, Mexico City. Uh, many things like this have given me a bit of a background to uh, look at the bicycle differently and come up with something that would excite uh, the bike's design and would create innovation, introduce innovation and uh, the round tail does that and I'm very proud of it. This bike is unique and some people might find it difficult to leave their comfort level and go to something as unique as the round tail is. But I believe it needs um, a chance and people need to see it up close and experience it, take it out for a ride. It will define itself. If you like the bike, you'll buy it. It's just something different and something that provides a choice. And I think having a choice is a good thing. Uh, I'm excited that I've contributed to the cycling world and give someone the choice of something different and unique that can help in the rider's passion to ride more and to experience cycling as I have over the years. We as a company developing this bike stand behind it. Uh, we would guarantee that it's got to be high quality, good performer, meet everyone's satisfaction of what they're looking for. Whatever it takes, we want you to try this bike. We know you're gonna like it. The finite element analysis of this frame have demonstrated that in fact, uh, the uh, standard triangle frame flexes 0.002 of an inch, where the round tail flexes 0.02 or 10 times more. It's just something that your back appreciates over long periods of rides. And the mathematics indicate that for 67 units of strain, only one makes it to your back, where on a standard triangle geometry, every unit of strain makes it to your back. We have improved uh, the ride considerably. We've made it exciting and fun, and the round tail frame, it's, it's a thing of beauty. It allows you to clean your bike easier, get to your components faster, is a work of art. Testing was the equivalent of 10 years use on the frame and the bike took that testing and uh, was ASDM certified. Everything is coming back very positive. Seeing this new design, I would love to get out and ride this and see how it does. But it just looks comfortable. You can see how your ride's gonna be a lot softer. It's beautiful. I wanna see it in some more colors. Uh, I wanna see it riding down the street. It looks crazy, but it actually really, really works. Based on my first impression, it's pretty neat. It's a very intriguing design. No one's tried anything remotely close to this in the 150 years of the bicycle's existence. I knew I had to get someone's help in this project that was very experienced in the bike business and I found Steve Bemke who is in the Mountain Bike Hall of Fame and he has a PR company that helps people like myself launch a new uh, a new bicycle or, or new projects such as this and we toured a number of magazines throughout California, they're mostly based there. I was really fortunate with his background and, and, and uh, relationships. He walked into people's offices and called ahead and we were there. The editors gave us lots of time with the bike. They called their photography staff out. They got it, they saw it, they appreciated the design. It just has to be a bike that people will walk into a store and go, well, that's the bike for me. I, I like the look and feel and, and the uniqueness of it. And that, that would make me happy if five years from now I'm at some distant city somewhere in the world and a round tail frame, a round tail bike goes by and some stranger is riding it. I'll just be standing there appreciating the fact that that was my uh, thought process and my hard work that went into it and something that I created uh, and it's my legacy and something that I'm very, very proud of and I hope uh, you'll like it too.